Tech. Nako, inyong narinig ang isang napakagandang awitin mula sa ating napakahusay na guest. Diba? For a change, diba? Usually, ang mga guests natin ay mga singers. But this time, he's an amazical, amazical, amazing, ano, halong amazing and classical. Amazing classical guitarist. Hello, Jacob. Hello. Welcome to Letters and Music. It's so nice to have you here. It's very nice to be here. And thank, thank you, you so for much. sharing your music with us. How long have you been playing the guitar? I've been playing guitar longer than I would like to admit. Far longer than <laughs> forever, even after forever like that? Yes, I, I, all right. I, I, I started when I was about this big, very, very oh, young. Oh, really? And yes. now you're this tall already. And now I'm this tall, exactly. Yeah, good thing yeah. you're sitting on a chair. <laughs> That's so right. I can see your face and your green eyes. Very yes. nice. Well, thank anyway, you. <laughs> we have Facebook questions for you. Is it okay? Absolutely, of course. Because our viewers are very excited when they heard that you'll be guessing in our show. Very nice. So here goes. Happy to answer questions. Here's something from Jamie Libadisos. Sabi niya, what's the inspiration regarding your music career? I guess uh, he's trying to ask, if, what are your inspiration? That's a very good question, actually. My first, imp uh, first inspiration came when I was actually here in the Philippines. Oh, really? When I was 10 years old. Wow. I'd only just been learning how to play the guitar. Mm -hmm. And I saw a concert, and there was one piece that I heard, and I thought, I would like to do that for a living. I would what like to be. What song was that? What it piece was a was piece that? called Cavatina. Oh, it's a, which they use in the film uh, The Deer Hunter. It's a oh, wonderful I piece see. by Stanley Myers. But that was the first inspiration, seeing these musicians on stage mm -hmm. playing the guitar here in the Philippines, and I thought, I would like to do that for a wow. living. Wow. Who are your musical influences, by the way? Oh, there's so many. I don't think we have time enough to talk <laughs> about them. <laughs> I listen to Just a lot of music. Just give me one. Just give me one. Just give you one. Okay, there are two guitarists, actually. Mm -hmm. Can I give you two? They're brothers. They're called the Assad brothers. Uh, oh. Sergio and Odeir Assad. They're Brazilian guitarists and oh, they play in a duo. And they make the guitar sing and it's just fantastic. They're absolutely wow. wonderful musicians. I better research on that. I'm you not should. very much familiar on the famous guitarist, but of course, I'm very much willing to look them up on G Google, right? Yes, absolutely. So here's another one from J.H. Niserio E. Nagaliza. Hello, po, Letters and Music. How long na po siya will stay here in the Philippines? Right, talaga, oh. And share his most memorable experience here and with Filipino people. How long will you be staying here in the Philippines? Unfortunately, only until Saturday. Why? Yes. Uh, no, because I have Why to keep going short? on tour. I have more concerts to play. Ah. I would love to stay here more time, actually. I've had such a good time. Mm -hmm. This is actually my third time here in the Philippines. Third time? The first one the was when time. you were 10 years old, right? Ah, no, then I lie. Fourth time. Fourth because time. Because it's the third time playing concerts here as an adult. Oh. I see. So and what's your most favorite thing here in the Philippines? Your favorite food? Your favorite place? Actually, the, the food is my favorite thing. Wow. Yeah, the food here is... Everything that I've had is so nice. What's uh, your most favorite Filipino food? Do you like the balot? Have you tried I it? I have tried the balot, really? yes. Did if you, you eat if, the sisiu? If you close your eyes... <laughs> <laughs> as long as you don't look... No, it's actually very tasty. But I had something last night, which was this... Um, it's not very healthy for mm -hmm. you, I mean, but it's this pork with very crispy skin. That oh, it's lechon. Yeah. Is it lechon? Oh my goodness, it's that's very, very nice. yummy. It's very and it also rice that they cook in a bamboo. Uh huh. Oh yeah, yeah. and then they hit exactly. it with the thingy. Yeah. yeah. So did you eat at? No, I'm not gonna mention the restaurant, but I think <laughs> I know the restaurant. <laughs> anyway, what's the other question? I think he's asking, uh, what's your most uh, memorable experience here in the Philippines? The, I think the actually just getting to know different people here mm -hmm. in the Philippines because I've been very fortunate as well to give some master classes and some, wow. some lessons to some young Filipino guitarists. And everybody I heard there was one yesterday. There was one yesterday uh -huh. and another one on Friday as well. And another actually. one on Friday. That's yes. very good. And, and the people are so friendly and mm -hmm. the standard of music is very high here. And so it's, it's, very, it's very memorable to come and, and share ideas and talk about mm -hmm. music with the young Filipinos. Wow. Do you have any uh, particular uh, favorite Filipino singer? Do you know uh, any Filipino singer here? I, 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 don't, I don't remember any of the names, but I'm I was singer. given... You're a no, singer. You <laughs> are my favorite. <laughs> I knew it. Thank you. No, I'm just but kidding. I, 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 have a, I have a book that was, that was made um, and arranged by, by a great guitarist here, Joe Valdez. Oh. And, and all of this OPM. Mm -hmm. And there's some wonderful Filipino music that... I don't remember the names of the titles. My mm -hmm. Tagalog is not very good. Do you know how to play any OPM uh, classical music, I guess? Uh, maybe if people come to the concert on Thursday, they oh, might be... <laughs> it's going to be exciting. Uh. <laughs> they might be surprised. Oh, you have to see that concert. But here's another one from Carlito. Enera Enerlan Bingil. What's his favorite music or song? Can you he give us a sample? 
Uh, again, that's a very difficult question because mm -hmm. I listen to so much music and I play so much music. And the nice thing about the guitar is that under the, the, the umbrella or the mm -hmm. title of classical guitar, you can play anything from Renaissance music, mm -hmm. bar Baroque music 500 years ago, to Latin American music, to Filipino music, Australian music. Uh -huh. And there's so much variety that it's very, very difficult to say just one song. Uh, but Although I can, if I were to ask you to play a song, just a little bit of a song, what song would you play? Perhaps it would be that one that I heard here when I was first as a 10-year-old, this oh, Cavatina. Oh, this yeah. Cavatina. Okay, can we hear the song? Okay, I'll hear hold just the mic a little for bit you. of it. Yeah. All right, awesome. like a very hypnotizing it's very beautiful really yes, it's, it's really beautiful, beautiful and relaxing okay I'll, j I'll just listen to his music and oh, we'll end the show no just kidding here's one more question for you here's from Juanito Hualde for him what is music and what is the importance of music wow it's a, a very beauty pageant question <laughs> beauty pageant ish question yes <laughs> um I think fundamentally at its mm -hmm. at its core music is just communication. Mm -hmm. Music is like speech. And in the in the same way that we can talk here mm -hmm. and and we can talk to to anybody you meet in the street and you can share ideas and share thoughts. I think for me music is is that. It's communication in a language that's understood by everybody. Yeah, there's no language barrier when it comes no. to music, right? And and you can share so many uh, very complex mm -hmm. ideas and emotions and thoughts and things about politics or about love mm -hmm. or about friendship or about all sorts of things that can be expressed in this communication between the musician and mm -hmm. the audience. All right, that's awesome. Thank you so much for uh, accommodating our questions for you. My pleasure. And I'm sure our viewers are very much excited to hear you play once again. So later on, we'll promote your show. But for now, I think once again, let's give it up for Mr. Jacob Cordover.